Hello there, and welcome to March Madness day number 12. It's another grey March day, and uh, while the weather was actually nice for playing disc golf, like not too much wind, um, I did actually have other things in mind, such as starting to make the back tags for, for the e Orton Club, for the Hilo Road Club. But of course I couldn't find the USB stick that had the designs on them. So I have to find that before I can start making those. So I thought I'm not gonna do, uh, do the review review, but I would like to actually go out and throw a few discs. So I'm bringing the, the two prototype ocean discs. Um, and I'm probably going to have to have to insert the name here because I already forgot it. I just read the text. It's called something with turtle. Maybe it's called turtle. All I can tell you is that this is made in the, this is the this is the ocean plastic uh, version. They have they're going to be come out with this uh, disc in two uh, different plastic types. One is the ocean plastic, which is currently supposedly 60% recycled plastic from her ocean waste and uh, there's going to be a, a premium plastic version as well. The base plastic version is is 5-5-1-1 five, five, one, one, and the premium plastic is going to be 5-5-0-1 five, five, so a little bit more straight and um, yeah it is a cold day these are as you saw in the unboxing they are fairly stiff but um, like they are actually really stiff. It's really hard to to uh, to do anything with them. They're supposed to be torque resistant. See the weight written in here is 177 grams on both of them. So fairly heavy chunkers, fairly f really flat. Um, so yeah, let's. Uh, I'm at the crocodile course today called Fredsoften. Um, and I'm just going to be playing, I think I'm going to be playing maybe hole 18 and hole number 1. Just to get a few shots in for the day. So let's go. And I think... And I think actually just to... Uh, just to see. It is, they are mid-ranges, but uh, I still want to see how they how they putt. Just like the, like the lift moles where... I had bigger success putting with most of them than actually throwing. Well, a little on the weak side, but that was me. They went in. Okay. Ah, okay. That was all on me. I didn't give them a chance at all. So, let's go and throw these bad boys before, before I lose all my concentration just putting. So we see the basket is still in the winter position on the left. It's still like Fredshofen is known for having quite muddy ground, so it's it's probably it's gonna be a little while before they move the basket to the to the right position where where it's quite muddy at the moment. Oh! So I can definitely recommend not stepping over the edge of the G-pad. So let's move you guys a little bit. There we go. That was a yank, but kind of shows how frozen eyes are. Comes out. They are 
I mean they're brand new, so they are a little bit stable. Go for a long floaty. Yeah, that's a good, that's how you get par on this hole. Lefty for the in crowd. Regular for the others. Well, maybe a little bit of Anheuser and then this way. Okay. Okay. So, good thing I got stopped by a tree there. I tried a little run up just to position myself distract myself from not being able to release the disc. It actually held quite a nice line. Unfortunately, it was the wrong way. There's a bit of a sidearm gap way up there. So let's see. That was uh, close to perfect. Low speed, it does fade out quite a bit. Easy. Ooh, no! Oh, well. That was my first froze with the ocean discs. That was my first froze with the Ocean Discs Sea Turtle, I'm pretty sure it's called. Stable mid-range. If you give it a little, I think maybe when they beat in a little bit, they will become a little bit flippy for the, for the people with the arm for it. For me, it'll probably not be more than a stable mid-range. But uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna go, if the weather is nice, oh, tomorrow I'm gonna go work on back tacks if I find my USB stick. Oh, USB stick. Anyway, I think for the next one disc round in Vium, there's going to be a one disc here for March as well. I think I'm gonna play with the ocean with that sea turtle here. And maybe I'll have someone else throw it as well, just to, just to get their impression on how it flies. Anyway, thank you for sticking around for this just two holes in Anagans with me not being able to throw this properly again. And thank you to the Patreon supporters, which is probably one of you guys, one of you 10 guys watching. Thank you very much. See you tomorrow. And yes, I did read that comment about me filming while I go in the box to find your disc. Maybe in April.